Hey, family. So here's what's been going on. I'm excited. On I'm just excited. I don't know. This is the perfect day or the perfect way to start the day. The day, okay? But we got to talk to them people so we can get them some more money on. These are the ones that I've already did. These are the ones y'all just seen me do. Now that you're all cut up, let's move on to the next video. Good morning, y'all, and welcome back to another video by me, your favorite cousin, Tish Tier. So today is Sunday, and it is also Cinco de Mayo. So, um... We got to do the grocery list. We got to get ready to go to the grocery store. We got stuff to do, okay? Um, Yeah, ain't no, ain't no other way around it, honestly. Like, we just we got shit to do. We need to write out the day. We got to get a video prepared to go out tonight. We just got stuff to do. I think we got to go to the bank. We just got stuff to do. But um, we doing Cinco de Mayo in Nana House. So, we doing Cinco de Mayo with the family. Everybody's talking about what they're going to bring. So, girl, that water was good. I always hydrate with water. First thing in the morning, drink your water and mind your business. Um, but yeah, so we're doing sick all the my own and now the house over there. So I gotta stop by the liquor store and get some um Jose Cuevo, some flavored Jose Cuevo. And um I also gotta get the chips. I said I was gonna bring some chips and like some queso dip. Somebody else said they bring in um they're doing some like some stuff for shrimp tacos. Everybody just signing up for different stuff. So uh, we gotta do that. It is 833. Um, yeah. I'm sorry that it took y'all so long to get that last vlog. But that was a vlog that was supposed to go up before that vlog. If you watched my last vlog, then you know that I had a whole week of footage just completely be fucking destroyed. And I'm pretty sure I know how it happened because when you get done sending stuff to your computer, your computer be telling you that you need to hit the eject button. And so sometimes if you don't hit that eject button, it will corrupt the footage an idiot so that sucks for me but we still got a good vlog coming out or it's already out at this point by the time y'all see this clearly um we got packages to order for color me cute we really just got a lot of shit to do so much stuff that i i really just need to go ahead and write it all out on the agenda for today because i also need to order armani's suits and her shoes and stuff for her um they're having like their middle school formal or whatever coming up. Her and Anaya. I already ordered Anaya's dress. I just got to order Anaya's. Um, well, I told her we're going to go find her shoes personally. So we got to go get her shoes and stuff like that. But yeah, that's what's going on this morning. Um, Just a whole lot of... What, what is it that I want to call it? I don't know. That's a brief on how today's going to go. But now I need to do the background work which is writing it all down, figuring out what's our top six for the day, and go from there. I have not set step foot in the gym in two weeks, so we'll also be going to the gym starting on Monday. There's a lot of gym shit gonna be going on. Um, I don't know if y'all saw, I don't know if um, y'all saw that I did get some samples coming in, so I gotta get all of that ready for my manufacturer and everything so she could tally up that big ass total girl i i need to figure out how much of everything i even need to, girl i've been trying not to even think about it i keep thinking about it but i've been trying not to think about it at the same time um what else my body is telling me it wants some fruits for breakfast so wherever we go probably just stop and get like a nice little fruit bowl although actually we gotta stop at all these we gotta stop at all these first um so actually we'll probably be stopping by planet smoothie to get a smoothie first mm -hmm. i'm listening at kobe because kobe right here i kind of hear some action going on up there i was just about to say that kobe yeah i thought i heard them that's d coming down with serena but yeah that's today's brief of everything that gotta go on like i said let me write down my schedule and figure out life in I come back to y'all. Probably by the time I see y'all again, we'll already be at Aldi's doing our grocery shopping. I'll let y'all know what the budget is and all of that stuff when I come so, back. So, we are now at Aldi's. I'm in the parking lot. So, the food budget for the week is $270. And, um, yeah, watch me work. 
starting off with Aldi's. Y'all know we always start off with Aldi's. The lighting is not good. So I'm at Aldi's now, and the food budget for the week is two seventy. Watch your girl work. Starting off with, like I said, Aldi's. Y'all know you always start off with Aldi's, okay? Always start off with Aldi's if you have a big family. At this point, even if you don't have a big family, baby, like it can just be two of y'all. Food is food is getting up there. Start off with Aldi's when you're doing your grocery shopping for the week. You're not gonna be able to find everything that you need at Aldi's, but it's definitely gonna help your food budget. Nevertheless, um, I forgot to say y'all. So your girl got pulled over yesterday. So I'm minding my own business, coming from work. And so a police officer and it was a sheriff girl. So the sheriff pull up or whatever like that. And I'm like, I know this Negro is not about to pull me over. So he drive on the side of me, then he let me go up a little bit and then he pulled me over. I'm like, okay, nigga. So I roll out my window, whatever like that. It's a black officer. So when it was a black officer, I'm like, okay, I got this in the bag because I ain't never got no ticket by no black man. I always got a ticket by white man whatever but even if, if it's a man period i'm gonna get off i'm gonna get off nine times out of ten but if i do get a ticket it's gonna be from a white guy it's never from a black guy so i say a black guy I'm like, okay cool because well, at first of all i'm not even doing anything so i don't got no drugs in my car i was not speeding at least i didn't think i was um and like i'm like all my lights on my car work the whole night like what's up so he said something to me about my headphones because y'all i i love my headphones i wear my headphones every where cuz don't talk to me <laughs> not y'all y'all can talk to me but like strangers it helps with my anxiety to have my headphones on and to kind of like be in my own world or whatever so um yeah and so he was like um why you got your headphones on I was like because I'm on the phone I was on the phone with Tiffany so I'm like because I'm on the phone <laughs> So we spent $62.09 in all these. Kroger and Walmart could never, it would have been $100. I'll be telling y'all. And I just spent $32 or something like that. Like 30, yeah, like $32 in Family Dollar. supposed to be going to my grandma's house and like spending this time over there. We're supposed to be doing Cinco de Mayo, all this other stuff. And now you're talking about she don't feel good and or she really didn't feel good yesterday. Say she feel a little better but her thoughts sore. But her auntie said now she don't feel good so that lets me know that whatever it is, it can be transferred and so I can't have her around. My mom, my cousin. Like, my grandma and my cousins and all them, like, they, they get sick fairly easy, so. I can't have the girls around them, so now, I'm, like, trying to figure out what's about to be the situation, because I want to kind of take part in Cinco de Mayo, just a little bit, like, not a lot, but just, you know, like, doing it with the family, like, that was going to be cute. It's hot as hell outside. I don't know. At this point, shit, at this point, and this part just don't know. I did say too that I wanted to light the fire outside when the sun go down. So we might do that. Probably do like some um 
what you call it some s'mores or whatever and find something to eat I, I don't know we'll see what happens when I get with the girls but to leave in like 12 minutes so to the gym it's raining outside which is crazy because i didn't think that it would still be raining we were supposed to do s'mores and stuff last night but it was raining so we didn't do that and i wake up girl i've been up since one something so novi came home um denise she went out she does hair so she left to go do two clients here and she didn't get home to like one something this morning. And for those of y'all that don't know, when I'm woke, it's so hard for me to go back to sleep if I'm woke up out of my sleep. I started to go to the gym at like two something. I was like, that's way too early. Like, just in case nobody was there. Um, I was like, that's just way too early. So I waited it out. Tried to see if I was going to be able to go back to sleep. I laid in the bed for like an hour and a half. No sleep. I was not able to go to sleep. So I was like, girl, just get up and prepare to go to the gym. It's really all you can do. So I guess I'm going to turn on, write out my day. Um, and as soon as I'm done writing out my day, we're going to, uh, we're just going to go ahead and head to the gym. I'm not going to record it on here because I am going to record on my phone. Y'all know y'all can always catch those on my shorts so and today is leg day and we also gonna get a chance to see how this um how this material performs in the gym how it holds with sweat and just all of that type of jazz but um this morning some motivational message i listen to something motivational every morning so this morning's motivational message it comes from et the hip-hop preacher and the name of it is called Don't Touch It. So we're gonna see what that's about.
All right, y'all, I am back from the gym. That was a very good workout, very good workout. Um, and I wore the sample piece from the new um, collection that's gonna drop. And I understood the assignment. Now it's time to get in some reading, so we doing behind her eyes. So I said the last, in one of the vlogs that I was gonna tell y'all about like what was going on in the book. So, so far, it's this lady who works in, I guess like for, no, she works for a doctor. She's like an assistant for a doctor. And she met him at the bar um, one night first, before she even knew that this was her boss. Met her at the bar. They had like really good chemistry. They shared a kiss. And, but he wouldn't let it go no further. So it left her kind of like, what is wrong with him? Like, dang, like, what did I do? Only to find out that it's her new boss and he has a wife. The wife, and it, it goes back and forth between the wife and her. The wife and her husband, aka the doctor, they're like in a real bad spot in their relationship. And so, um, like the wife tries to do everything that she can to, you know, try to make him, basically try to make things back the way they were. So, that's what's going on in this book. If you can find it, get it. I got it for $3.97 from a bookstore. Um, but... I would also strongly suggest that you look on thrift books. Thrift books is actually where I go 98% um, of the time to look for my books. Okay, y'all. Uh, so I am done editing tomorrow's vlog. That was, it originally was four hours of footage. And I got it down to like right under an hour. So maybe like 58 minutes or something like that. Now I gotta go to the stove. So I can cook the girls hamburger helper before I go to work. Of course they're not gonna eat it till later. But they don't like how each other cook the hamburger helper. So I'm gonna cook it and make sure it's right. But I gotta go to the stove so I can get some cow milk. Um, because I don't like cooking with almond milk. Unless it's something sweet like cornbread or something like that. That's the only time I use cow milk because even if it's say like unsweet it still tastes sweet good morning y'all i feel like when i left y'all the last time i talked to y'all i was probably down here in this office that could just be a thought i'm not completely sure all right y'all so today is tuesday it's 7 49 in the morning and um i'm getting ready to package some orders so i'm getting ready to package up some orders so i can get those sent out i need to clean up my office which i'm probably finna do that before I package my orders. Um, and then I have to decide what's going to happen with all of this inventory. I should do a giveaway. I should do a giveaway. I should. That's what we're going to do. So, I do have um, quite a bit of inventory to get rid of. And, yeah, I'm just going to... Oh, what better way than to do a giveaway? So... This giveaway is going to consist of people who I know for a fact support me. Whether that is I see you comment or like stuff all the time on Instagram. Whether I see you comment or whatever all the time on YouTube, TikTok. It does not matter, okay? This giveaway, like I said, would be consisted of people who support your girl, okay? If you like, girl, I've been here for years, like whatever. If you support me, I want you to enter this giveaway. So, when you enter this giveaway, I want you to tell me. And and uh, this giveaway does not have to be for you. So, I don't want to say, tell me your Zodiac sign or nothing like that. Because some of a lot of y'all have shopped with me before. And so, if it's something that you already have, then I don't kind of want to give you the same thing twice unless you just need it. One thing I know for a fact is my necklaces and stuff do not tarnish Okay, so if you had my Zod if you had a Leo Zodiac sign and you bought it two years ago, it's still in good condition. You feel what I'm saying? But okay, so this is what we're gonna do. and I know Mother's Day and stuff like that is coming too. So damn, by the time y'all see this Mother's Day, it'll be gone. Anyway, anyway, I'm just trying to get all my thoughts together because I did not have them together. So all right, if you want to enter the giveaway, leave a comment down below. I know who I see all the time that come in. All right, so I ain't even gonna trip about. Anyway, comment down below 
when you comment down below, I want you to leave um, sizes, whether or not it's your size or not. I don't care if it's for you. I don't care if it's for a friend, whatever. So I want you to leave whatever sizes you could use and whatever zodiac signs you could use. Okay, so leave both of those down below. I need sizes, I need zodiac signs. And that's it. That's how you enter the giveaway. Hey, Tisa, size this, zodiac sign this. Boom, wham, bam. That's it. Um, And I'm going to get that stuff out to y'all. The only thing is about that, okay, that's how we'll do this. Leave whatever sizes you can use. Use whatever zodiac signs you need. And leave a way for me to get in contact with you. Preferably Instagram, but I know everybody don't have an Instagram. I'm not going through emailing people. I need you to have an Instagram. That's just what's going to make it easier for me. I need you to have an Instagram. So list your Instagram name below, whatever sizes you could use, whatever zodiac signs you could use, and then, because that's how I'm going to contact you. I'm going to contact you through Instagram. So, yeah, like I said, I need to clean up my office first. It's not destroyed, but it's a little messy. So I'm gonna find something to watch on YouTube. Do wanna watch Gina? Gina says she traveled to four states in four days. I usually don't care for. I watch a travel vlog every now and then, but I really don't care for party vlogs. I may watch a travel vlog. I just prefer like good regular vlogs. Like what are you doing on your regular day to day situation type of thing? Oh, Chelsea. Chelsea takes the cake. Okay, y'all. So my according to. YouTube, because you know it'll tell you everybody that you subscribe to, but then it also tells you who, like, I guess you watch the most, maybe. So, my faves are Peyton Marie Charles, Life of Lily, my Mashaya Major, I am Chelsea. Chelsea is my favorite YouTuber right now. I am, um, I am Chelsea. I watch, oh, Taja, I love Taja, Gina. It's something that he didn't put on here. Like, uh, what's her name? Glamour Zante. And I watch her. But we're gonna watch Chelsea. Because Chelsea said so much. She, she went solo trip to Miami. I can do a solo trip to Miami. Girls trips and all of that. I don't be wanting to hear all this squealing and yelling. If people like, I don't know. I just be calm. I just got done packing orders with four minutes and eight seconds to spare. So I guess I would tell y'all what I got left. So I don't know in melanin, the two keys, a uh, plus size set, melanin, a few melanin in yellow, the tie-dye dress, and then I have um a lot of jewelry because before i decided that i was going to rebrand before i had decided that i was going to rebrand i had bought a whole bunch of the jewelry so i got some jewelry for y'all um and the way i'm gonna do it is i'm probably gonna do like i don't know i don't know however it go it go you're gonna if you win the giveaway, you're definitely going to get more than one thing. You're probably going to get more than two things. It just all depends on what all you put down in the description thing. Alright, so we done made it out the door. And I am on my way to work. Hopefully, it's another good day. Yesterday was a good day. We need another good day today. I just want a good day all week. Like, can I have you? A good day all week from work? In this game, or any hustler's game... You got to understand there's going to be a bad day. There might be multiple bad days. You might have a bad week. You might have a bad month. But we're not going to speak any of that into existence. I hope that we win the week. And by winning the week. And we and we win the week by having more good days than bad days. That is a win for the week. So we're already 1-0. Oh, one good day, no bads. Knock on wood. Today's a great day also. All right, y'all. So I am home from work. And me and the girls were supposed to make s'mores a few days ago. Two days ago, but they had started raining. So we finally got clear skies. 
We're gonna make some s'mores because it's gonna rain. It's gonna rain Thursday. All right, now, mommy. We have some a lizard in here, so it might burn. I'm gonna light it. I'll get it out the way. Wait, wait. I'm not. Me, Marshmallow. Wait, Ashley. Money, is there anything right here? Huh? Like, is there anything right here on top? No. I'm pushing you in that pool. Money, I don't, I don't and know my chocolate you. melted. I'm huh? going to push you in that pool. I don't care how mad you are. Uh, it depends on how hot your marshmallow TikToks should be. Mm hmm I like it out here. It's nice. It has to see Debo in there. Today is Wednesday. I'm downstairs. I am preparing to, um, right out my day. I originally wanted to like either go to the gym or work out from home, which I kind of, it's hot as fuck. Which I kind of figured maybe because I got this wool ass thing going and some pants in summer. But um, yeah, I wanted to do something workout related today. I knew I probably wasn't gonna go to the gym, but I had intentions on getting up at four to work out at home, didn't set my alarm clock. And then I had asked y'all on Instagram, did y'all want a home workout or a gym workout? And I woke up this morning and legit the votes were 50-50. So I'm like, y'all about to piss me off. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go for a run. How about that? So yeah, I'm gonna go for a run, get some good cardio in. I haven't gone for a run in a while. And the perfect time is actually to do it before it gets hot. Cause we've been like in the 80s lately. So go ahead, get a good, um, a good run in probably listen to somebody honestly it'll probably end up being my um probably end up being my business coach because i think we're supposed to have a live last night that we didn't have for whatever reason i don't know i'm confused on that but unless i missed it i don't i just don't know i just don't honestly i don't know um so i gotta see what's going on with that but yeah i'm at a point in my life where i'm like something has to change that something is me but it's like what about me you know like I need to write down everything that I see my future self being I need to write down everything that I see when I say oh I'm gonna show up as her what does showing up as her look like who is she what does she do what does she like you know and I just need to write all of that down and moving forward anything that's not conducive to her just yeah no <laughs> you know what I mean like they say if you you can change your life in six months I would like to see what that looks like for me this is May June July August September October November before New Year's I could be a, a completely different person if I really zone in on what she looks like she already does not eat meat and I love that for her so six months down the road I mean that's you know that's great I can be moving on to something greater because changing your eating habits like that like just waking up one day and saying I'm no longer gonna eat something that's big but what else does she do what else does she do she wants to go to coffee shops to work she wants to like that that's that is going to be a part of my meditation this morning I'm gonna meditate and I'm gonna write it all down and I'm gonna see I'm gonna work towards becoming her I am I really am because something's gotta change in life it really does and I definitely want to romanticize my life more like I want to be romantic towards myself like you know how some people say like everything that you want in a man you have to become that first type of ordeal like I feel like that even goes for romance I should take myself out more I really should take myself on solo trips buy more flowers like all of the things all of the things y'all just all of the things becoming her the next six months to a year i will be becoming her and you guys are gonna see me become her whatever her is that's gonna be me but right now her needs to write out her day because she is very disciplined with her time she's very intentional with her time she doesn't just give her time to anything she doesn't she has to see the benefit from it so and she's gonna listen to something motivational okay y'all so we at the house and we are on the way to the gas station first and foremost and then 
after we leave the gas station i got some packages right here that need to go to the post office these are the packages that i packed up yesterday so we got to take those to the post office and then i need to stop by the bank because i need to put money that i have saved for savings for last month and then like some of this month but it's so it's like the beginning of the month so but um the money that i save that needs to go into debt needs to go into the bank and then the money that i saved for savings also need to go to the bank and then i need to figure out like what where am i gonna put that money to make that money work for me um half of the money half of the money that's in my debt pal is going to go towards investment and then the other half will go to breaking down debt so i have um robin hood on my phone i think i have robin hood i think that's the one d told me to um download because he invests through one of those also i think it's robin hood or is it acorn i don't know needless to say it's one of the two so i'm gonna get on that today while i'm at work because a lot of a lot of what I do includes also sitting down. Like you might sit down for like three hours, maybe, before the club um, pop off. So I be having like a little downtime that I have started to put towards like actually doing something. So I'll clear off my list of the things that I need to actually be present to do, and then the other things that I can just like do from anywhere you know being it if it's on my phone or something like that i'll do later y'all i gotta go to the eye doctor um very soon like if i can make it to the eye doctor this week i want to go because i need to get my fucking eyes checked like even with me having contacts and stuff in it's like yeah i can uh oh i can see i can read i can do all of the things but it's still a whole lot blurry than what i know my vision is supposed to be and i think i see better out of my I see better out my right eye than I do my left which I've known that for a while but they used to tell me like the prescriptions were so close that it didn't really matter but being that my prescription is so off at this point it definitely matters so oh yeah and I got some gray we're rocking gray right now. The ones that I've been had in my eyes, the dark brown ones, those just had like a little tear in it. So I threw those away this morning. So we're rocking gray. I appreciate it. All right, so we done doing that. Now we gotta go to the bank. And I'm excited about going to the bank. Because going to the bank for me means going to Starbucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't wait to give me a grilled cheese, girl. But yeah. Tracking cancel. I don't even know what the fuck that means. Anyway, let's go to the bank and get us um, grilled cheese and something to eat. I mean, well, grilled cheese is just something to eat. But grilled cheese and our favorite, a caramel uh, ribbon crunch. No crunch. Good morning, beautiful. It's Thursday morning. It's like nine something in the morning. Oh, it's nine eleven. Just went to Waffle House. Got Waffle House. They wanted something from his cafe that he liked to go to, so we went there too, so he could get a salmon bagel. But I wanted Waffle House because I wanted a grits. I don't think I'm going to work today. They say it's supposed to rain all day today. Thunderstorm and everything, so I don't think I'm going to work. And I ain't gonna say I drank too much, but I'm gonna say I did drink yesterday. And today I'm just not feeling my best because I'm not a drinker. And so when I get to taking shots back to back, my, my body just don't be agreeing with that shit. And so I'm paying for it this morning when I know I shouldn't have did that anyway. Find something to watch on Netflix or something like that. I don't even feel like watching YouTube. Usually throughout the day, I watch YouTube. I don't even feel like watching YouTube. I just want to find me a movie or something and eventually go to sleep. <laughs> What's up, y'all? I ain't talked to y'all since after I ate this morning, but 
me and the girls just went to Rec Room Shoes to get their shoes for their dance. It's not a dance. It is a dance. What is it then? Uh, a formal. That's not a dance. Isn't a formal a dance? No. Alright. So, they got their shoes for their formal. And um, now we are about to go to... Where we going? Where do I need to go? Where was we originally going? Oh no. Oh, we went to Dollar General already. I need to find a bank. So I can put some money in the bank. Because y'all, I'm getting ready to spend some money on a program that I am terrified of doing. But I think it's just imposter syndrome, honestly. But it's gonna show me how to brand my, um, I'm finna get ready to drop a 30 day fitness challenge for y'all because people keep asking me to drop something fitness related and i finally bit the bullet and i'm gonna do it um but since i'm gonna do it um i don't know i'm scared and it's 500 dollars. but also scared money don't make no money so um find a bank Y'all, we in a whole nother, we too, we, we in a whole nother county, child. I don't know. I ain't never even been in this county, I don't think. It's so country that the gas station that we at only got two pumps. <laughs> you got pump one, you got pump two, and that's it. In that thing right there. Yeah. What's that? What's that? The little, the diesel thing. Oh, the diesel thing? They got yeah. the uh, gas thing on it? Oh, okay. I get what you're saying. But yeah, child, we had to hurry up and stop at the gas station because I'm trying to chase not necessarily like chase anything for they can't even stop talking i be wanting them to shut up i don't even like when them to talk to me i be feeling like them things is a distraction because what if somebody trying to rob me and i'm distracted because the tv talking to me on the gas pump like shh, be quiet. we got three minutes to go till we get to the atm in the middle of 10 buck motherfucking fuck don't know where we at honestly i don't and my battery going down so or not going dying. My battery going dead. Good morning, y'all. It is Friday. So, happy Friday. Um, we're finna get ready to go to Starbucks. And then we're finna take Ashley to school. Her bus is... Her bus is all the way... Guys, in the next one. Lost. <laughs> it's still at the... Girl, it's still at the... Um, at, the at the automotive shop. Her bus is... is out of sight, out of mind. So, we're gonna go to Starbucks and we're gonna get her to school on time. It's 6 42, so let's get out of here. Drop off, stop at 7 35, I think. And I'm really not trying to get out my car. I mean, I got my pajama pants on. Like, I just really don't. I just don't. <laughs> I don't. But we're gonna change clothes just in case. Just in case. And I've been, I've been downstairs. I've been working because. We finna get to it. We finna, I'm finna drop a challenge. I don't know if I told y'all that. So it's gonna be called Commit to Fit. Okay? So it's gonna be a 30 day fitness challenge. That's my alarm to tell me to get up. Cause I've been sitting at my computer. I've been sitting at my computer working girl. And it's 6.40 in the morning. Like I'm on it for y'all. Um, but yeah. So it's gonna be called Commit to Fit. And it is a 30 day fitness challenge. And I'm really excited. I'm gonna make a Facebook community for y'all. So that y'all can like communicate and share pictures with each other that you don't necessarily want like on social media like on your instagram or whatever like that like y'all can talk to each other and y'all can encourage each other and y'all can push each other on and all of that good stuff or whatever so i'm gonna make um a facebook group for y'all and uh, um yeah i just can't i just can't wait to see the results like i, I want y'all to be on it i'm excited for y'all summer is around the corner Let's get these summer bodies together. I didn't know she was off on me. We at Starbucks. And my grilled cheese smells so good. Hello. Oh, okay. okay. I know they was them straight, the straight ones. Okay, thank you. But yeah, we at Starbucks. And this grilled cheese smells so good. So good. Starbucks has the best grilled cheese Mommy, in the world. Yes. I dare you to rip that like on uh, 
those commercials. How they be opening it up. It's already split. Like, it, it ain't gonna up to you. Look at that. Look at that. I'm telling you, they got the best grip. Hey, boo. So, we done made it home. I stopped and got some Chinese food on the way in. I got fried rice and egg roll. I got fried rice. I'm fixing the lighting on this camera tonight. I hate it. I gotta fix the lighting. I can't go another day. I can't. But I'm about to eat and I'm about to close out this video. Don't forget to join in on the giveaway. And if you are not new here, hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. If you are already subscribed, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.